one is nipped back and cop Lundell. In a place one does not wish to be copped. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That's really hurt, but I used to deploy the double box. I used to put two boxes, one on top of each other, and then tape them together. Put them in a jock strap, and the first one used to cushion the blow, and the second one the vibration. That way, <laughs> always felt safe. But. Why? Did, did you maybe think about getting a bat in the way at some point? I wasn't that good, Sumo. Uh, anything, I was a white ball player, so anything that seemed I was in trouble. Could play the, 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 the straight one, just straight down the line. Was, was there acoustic softening between the two of them as well? It worked well. I didn't patent the idea. Um, there's probably someone out there now thinking about how they could develop a system like that. And only Warren went batting, Grant? <laughs> yeah, generally, only when I was batting, Stephen. Never went to those sort of parties. I don't know where else you would wear, wear a contraption like that. Anyway, Blundell's still battling away there. He's batting nicely outside of his crease. I, I like the innovation he uses, the creativity to try and negate the swing and seam from these bowlers. I understand that your double box is now being used as an ashtray at the Cricketer's Arms in Thornton. Right there! That's <laughs> <laughs> into the over 41 without loss.